Mike Schmitz. We're here with Lamar Stevens. I uh, just finished a workout out here in LA. What are some of the biggest things you've been working on? What have been your focus in, in these workouts? Uh, just, you know, refining the tools that I already have, uh, continuing to be a great finisher around the rim, uh, you know, just working on different finishes and mainly just my shot, uh, being more consistent from three and my handle. When you're shooting it really well, yeah. what are the things you're doing well? Uh, I, I have a lot of energy in my shot, you know, my feet are set, and you know, I extend all the way. Um, you usually get a good arc on it when it's a really good shot. Uh, but those are the things I've been really focusing on, just you know, staying true to my mechanics and believing in the fundamentals that I've worked up to this time, and just staying confident with it. I know you're someone who studies the game very closely, yeah. watches a lot of basketball. What have you taken from kind of the playoffs, the bubble, uh, and you know, any trends that you're seeing or yeah. things that kind of uh, relate to your game? Yeah, I mean, the biggest thing I would say is just being a guy that can just guard multiple positions. You see, you know, rookies coming off the bench like, you know, Grant Williams and uh, Lou Dort and guys like that who just come in and take pride in their role and just, you know, whether it's just being a guy that's super tough and, you know, just mixes things up or takes pride in guarding James Harden like Lou did. So um, I know that's the biggest thing I took from it. Just the guys who want to be ready to play my role and come in and, and do whatever the team needs me to do for us to win. What has the interview process been like? I know you guys you yeah. know, did a bunch of Zooms, I'm sure, yeah. early on. What has that been like? Yeah, it's been cool. It's been really interesting just talking to different teams and getting to know guys and, and you know, just seeing what teams want, seeing what teams see in me and taking, you know, their strengths and their weaknesses and, and just applying it to my game and just, you know, trying to take a mental note for me to get better. So, you know, it's really been really informative for me and it's been great for me, to, you know, just to take my next steps and, and you know, across the board. And what about this virtual combine that we might yeah. have? What do you make of that? What do yeah. you think you can show if you do participate? Yeah, I think that I can show how uh, how much I've worked on my shot over this time. Um, and really just show the consistency from three that I have now that, you know, maybe I haven't shown before. Um, and also just show my athleticism and show, you know, all the things that I can contribute to a team. I think that I'm a guy that you can plug into a lot of different spots. Is there anyone else besides the names you mentioned that you've been watching and, and oh, yeah. you know, seeing I could play that type of role? For sure, like uh, P.J. Tucker, uh, Marcus Morris, yep. guy like, guys like that. Um, even like a Jeremy Grant, like, yeah. you, know, you know, he's a four man on, on the Nuggets and he just, you know, he guards and rebounds and just does what he, you know, he's supposed to do. So I think I can be a guy like that. How does your experience and kind of maturity help you as opposed to maybe some of these one and done guys? Yeah, I think it helps me because, you know, I've, I've played college for four years and I knew what it, the sacrifices is, is taken. I've grown each year being in college. So, you know, my maturity level right now, I feel like this is the perfect time for me to take that next step into the NBA. Just with my maturity level and my focus, just locked in and, you know, just staying focused and get, staying ready, you know, so I don't have to get ready. And I think, you know, that's just the biggest thing. And just, you know, being a guy that, you know, can come in and play right away, I think that's another thing that separates me. And I think I'm physical and strong enough, you know, to be able to, you know, have my impact on the game. Great. Well, Lamar, thanks so much, man, Thank and you. good luck the rest of the process. Thank you.